let us read. Once upon a time, there was a farmer who liked fruits. So he decided to grow fruits on his land. He worked hard to grow a variety of fruits. With hard work and care, the trees grew well. He took special care to grow grapes and watermelons in a small corner of his farm. When the fruits were all ripe and ready to be eaten, the farmer decided to gift the best fruit to the king. Then his wife said, This year the best fruits on our farm are the watermelons and the grapes. The farmer thought about it and said, Since it is a long journey to the palace, I shall take the grapes as watermelons are too heavy. So he put the branches branches of grapes in a basket and walked to the king's palace. The farmer reached to the palace. He told the palace guard that he had bought a gift for the king. The palace guard then took him to the royal garden. The farmer saw the king playing with the princess, so he quietly kept the basket full of grapes in front of him and sat down. When the king sat down to rest, the guard brought the basket of grapes to the king. The guard pointed to the farmer and told the king that the grapes were a gift from a farmer. The king saw the farmer. The king was still in a playful mood. He took a bunch of grapes from the basket. He plucked out one grape and popped it into his mouth. Then he plucked another grape and threw it playful, playfully at the farmer. When the grip hit the farmer's forehead, he said, Thank God. The king was surprised. He threw a grip again. The farmer again said, Thank God, I am blessed. The king asked the farmer, Why are you thanking God when I am throwing grips at you? The wise farmer replied with, with a smile, O oh, mighty king, I had grown the best grapes and watermelons on my farm. I chose the grapes to give to you. I imagine if I had bought watermelons. Indeed, God is great. Now, word meanings. Journey. An act of traveling from one place to another. Guard to protect. A royal having the status of a king or queen or a member of their family popped to strike or knock sharply wise showing good judgment answer the following what did the farmer grow on his farm he grew watermelon and grapes in his garden in his farm what did his wife say his wife said that the watermelon and grapes were the best fruits grown in the farm that year. Why did the farmer decide to take the grapes? He decided to take the grapes because they were lighter to carry than watermelon. What did the king do playfully? He plucked grape and threw it playfully at the farmer. Why did the farmer say thank God? He thanked God because he was fortunate to choose grapes to give the king, not watermelon. Think and say. The farmer in the story grew fruits. What else can a farmer grow? Vegetable, pulses, paddy, wheat, flowers, etc. Are there watermelon farmers? What are there women farmers? Do you know any? Yes. Rahi by Soma Popre. She is a farmer from Ahmednagar district, Maharashtra. 
If you meet a farmer, what would you say to them? I greet them, pay respect and appreciate for the work they are doing. Let's learn. The farmer knew that the watermelon was heavy and the grapes were light. The words heavy and light are opposite in meaning. Write the opposite of the underlined word. Thick book, thin book. Long journey, short journey. Soft cotton, hard rock. Slow tortoise, fast rabbit. Read the sentences. The ball is round. The tables are brown. Fill in the blanks with is or are. There were animals in the jungle. The table is made of wood. These mangoes are sweet. Raghuram is a tall boy. The toys are on the shelf. The book is on the table. The girls are at the shop. The car is on the road. Let's listen at you. Once a mighty elephant got a mighty coat. It went to buy a handkerchief, for handkerchiefs were sold. A hanky for an elephant. The sales girl was surprised. Sorry, sir, but we don't have a handkerchief. That's size, at you, said the elephant, and shook its mighty head. Forget about the handkerchief. Give me a seat instead. At you. So imagine you are visiting the big elephant. You know that the elephant has a cold. So what food items will you take with you? Grapes, bananas, watermelon, chiku, etc. Chandu's fruit salads. Chandu has written the steps for preparing a salad on few slips of paper. He makes them up. Think of the proper order and write down in the space given below. So the first mother cut some fruits for me. First I take some banana slices, then I add the apple slices. Next I put in papaya cubes. After that I add some grapes from a branch. Then I mix them all. Finally, I squeeze a lemon on it, adding a pinch of salt. Now, find fruits in the wreath, greed given below. <laughs>